In this video, I'm going to be showing you the process of how I made Starlight's gloves. The fabric that I used is a faux leather that has quite a nice stretch. So, let's get right into it. So with a cutting board behind, you want to start by placing your patterns onto your fabric and weighing them down. Sadly, I've lost where my fabric weights are, so I'm just using these at the moment. But make sure you're using proper fabric weights to do this. Once you've weighted your pieces, it's time to use your rotary cutter just to cut that fabric. So once you've got this cut out, you should have your glove panels, your gussets for your fingers, your elbow patch panels and your thumb panels. And the final thing to cut out are the two little triangles that would just be attached around the top of the glove. So for my fabric pieces cut out, I decided to start on prepping the palm of the glove. The mesh is first added to the underside of the palm. Around that star cut out, just add a zigzag stitch attaching both the fabrics together. Then I just prepped the finger inserts to add later on. Once I've sewn in my mesh stars, I'm then going to move on to my shoulder pads. For this, I just cut out the shoulder pad pattern into some crafting foam and layered it up just so I can then glue the fabric on top and stitch across the lines. So I've basted and sewn around the foam. Then I'm gonna add my finger gussets into place and then just sew around them. Once you've got those finger gussets in, then time to add in your elbow pad. For this I just cut out the shape and then folded around the fabric and pinned it in place. And I'm just going to top stitch that little section there, really close to the edge. So once you've got this sewn into place, it's then time to start adding the zip. Start with just one side of your glove and sew it into place. So before you start sewing your zip in, just make sure you add your zipper fit. To finish the zip, you want to just add a little hand stitch to the top, just so the zip head doesn't fly loose once you cut the zip down. Once I've got the zip in place, it's then time to add the little lycra triangle that's on our gloves. This is just pegged into place and zigzag stitched along the edge. So once you've got that one side in place of your little like resection, you then just want to start to sew around the outside of your glove to finish it. For this, you're gonna wanna take your time in pegging all your bits together. Once again, got my bags. I'm going to be travelling into London to do fitting on my gloves, so I'll take you with me. 
So this is a small clip of the fitting. They seem to fit really well. And to finish, I'm just going to add that zigzag stitch across the top, just to hem the top of the sleeve. And with that, that's my gloves done. So that's the process of how I made Starlight's gloves. If you're interested in getting a commission for yourself, or any alterations, there's a link in the description below where you can contact me. But if you want to see more from my Starlight project, be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.